That's a mystery, isn't it? Who am I? So? We find out. Alex said there's no file. I'll leave Kelly. If Kelly ordered a loving family man, that's what they'll give her. Lordy. How'd you like to join our team? Sure. I'd say bring it on. Why are you telling me this? Jess is never going to be happy till she finds out who she was and where she came from. It's your fault. You owe her. That's a great idea. Socialising with a mate. Well. Oh. Welcome to Safeway Security Options. She's convicted of murder. Let me in there. There's got to be more. They're still here. No, wait. Hold off until I know. My name is John Sheridan. What are you... Ah! Ah! I'm not going to let you mess with Jessica. Not anymore. Alec? Alec, if you're not coming home, it'll be really nice to let me know. Alec... Oh. Logan, Gordon Leach. Welcome, Gordy. Request current UN log. Locator ID has been terminated. Do you wish to notify wellness? Discount. You have chosen to discount. Is that correct? Yes. So I could organise a transfer. How about Uri and Jawa? I hear the natives have reverted back to the good old days. Eating their enemies' hearts out. Who won? Sir? The Austronesian files. Oh, wait. You missed the last quarter. Man, it was intense! Richard! managed to retrieve some footage, it's not much. They overrode the security with some kind of program. I thought we were tamper-proof. Virtually tamper-proof. Whoever it was really knew what they were doing. Oh, you sound really impressed. These people are terrorists and murderers. Don't you forget it. You know what they were looking for? Uh, they've covered their tracks well, so it's going to take some time. Find out why they were here and if they found it. You don't eat, you don't sleep, you don't shit until I get some answers. Yes, sir. Right. Where were we? I'm sorry to be calling so early. Never too early, Kel. Beautiful day. I take it you went up all night drinking and playing cards then? Me? No. Only Alex said he had a poker night, so I assumed you'd be there. Alex did? 
First I heard of it. So he's not with you? Afraid not. What's this? Alec didn't come home last night. Oh, really? Uh, have you tried calling him? Yes, he's not answering. Probably still sleeping it off. He probably is. You're right. Thanks, Stephen. Enjoy your walk. Will do. Why am I so reminded of leopards and spots? Um, I just thought I'd call and check. You know, he hadn't had another accident or... Oh, I'm afraid not, Kelly. We've had a very quiet night. Everyone's safe and sound. Oh, do you know? So there we go. I've just remembered. He said he was staying with his new friend, so... Thank you, Lani. Bye. Come on up. last night and he's not answering his peck and you thought he might be here oh, he said he was playing cards with Gordy oh okay but I didn't think to get his last name or number so uh, Alex said that you and Gordy were together oh, we were I mean we are sorry sorry a bit slow in the mornings I need a coffee can I uh, no thank you not for me Last night. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they were playing cards at Gordy's house. Strictly no women allowed. I don't know who's the bad influence, your guy or my guy. <laughs> anyway, if I see them first, I'll let them yes, know. Yes, I'd rather not wait. I need the car back. So, um, if I could have Gordy's number. Oh, you know what? I was just about to call him. Oh. Only it's a bit early. He gets a bit grumpy after a night on the tiles, so I might wait just a little bit. It's very understanding. But I'll tell him to send Alec home straight away or give you a call or whatever, okay? Or I could call him myself. Except Gordy's a little bit funny about his privacy, so I'd have to ask him first. It's to do with his job. If you could let him know as soon as possible, I would really appreciate that. Sure. So, um, you and Gordy don't work together? No, we... No. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to be noisy. I'm just a little anxious. Oh, I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. No, you're right. I'm sure you're right. <laughs> nice to meet you, Jessica. You too, Kelly. We got in there fine. Alex started hacking the computer. I don't know, I guess we are... I guess we weren't paying enough attention because they jumped us from behind. We fought back, but I don't know. I thought Alec was right behind me. He didn't make it. What do you mean, didn't make it? I, what does that mean? I couldn't go back in. I couldn't. They would have got both of us. Where is he now? I don't know. But what if they've taken him away? What if he's been replaced? We have to go and find we him. We can't. You can track him, can't you? He hasn't got a signal, Jess. His locator ID is no longer operational. What does that mean, terminated? You tell me what that means, oh, Gordon! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I am. I really am. I'm so sorry. Oh, this one. Tell to you to see what? Hey there. 
right? Can you hear me? Always a pleasure. I should know better. Oh. Was it your new friend? Who's this? Gordy. It was, wasn't it? Uh, I, I, I can't remember. You were heading out for a game of poker with him and you probably won all his money and he got angry and beat you up. <laughs> and the persecution. So. I didn't like him. Not from the first moment I saw him. I'll have to notify someone, the community constable, before he can do it to anyone else. Please, don't. There are alternative explanations. Well, you had been drinking, yes? Oh, yeah, you could say that. <laughs> so, yeah. walking in the dark and struck by a passing vehicle. All consistent with his injuries. Hey, 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 look, it, it'd just be pretty embarrassing uh, if I blamed Gordy and, and then found out it was my own <laughs> stupid fault. I suppose. Oh, don't you do this to me ever again? Oh, I'll, I'll try not to. And I still don't trust that Gordy. Or his girlfriend. Jessica, what's she... Yes, I went to see her looking for you. She said she'd get him to call me and he still hasn't. But suddenly the car was parked out the front of the house and I know it wasn't there this morning, so he must have sneaked back and dropped it off. Cal, or maybe she did. Maybe they're both in on it. Cal, Cal, I promise you this has got nothing to do with Gordy or, or Jessica. We really should let Alec get some more rest. Kelly. Oh. I've got a change of clothes, a toothbrush, and a spare pick, so you can call me any time. Oh, dear.
I lied about your injuries. Probably from a taser baton. It appears that someone tried to electrocute you. Was Kelly right? Did Gordy do this? Well, he was there. I'm still not sure. And where were you? you're going to have to trust me, Alec. The electrical burns are directly above your heart. Whoever did this was almost certainly trying to kill you. She was certain there were no security flags at all. No, and nothing they didn't check out. Makes sense. They were outsiders. Terrorists. Terrorists, right. So they're not chipped? No. You covered this in your briefing. Yeah, right. I, I, I'm still processing. Has anybody else picked up anything? These are evil bastards, Gordy. Committed to destroying our way of life. We let them walk right in here with our pants down, letting a computer tell us when to sit up and pay attention. You mean Johnny? Put there by bureaucrats and bean counters. They hamstring us with ridiculous rules, and when it all turns to crap, they can say, oh, it wasn't me, it's the technology! Recheck all the security flags. I want to know if they had any inside help. Right away. Oh, Gordy. Sir. Good to have you with me on this. It's a long story. Jesus, how do I even know it's you? Well, I don't think they've replaced me with this. What happened? It's a long story. <sighs> Tell me when I get there. Uh, no, no, you can't. It's too risky. I don't care. But... You know what? This time, you don't get to have a say in what I do. I'll be here. It is him. I just talked to him. That is so great. Well, where are you now? I'm off to wellness. All right, wait for me. I'll get away as soon as I can. No, it's okay. I'll send him your guts. Cheers. Bye. I'll... Request locator ID, Alec Ross. This locator ID has been terminated. Uh, close file. Request locator ID, Jessica Wilmot. Tracking, Jessica Wilmot. Bad news? Puzzling, perhaps. As we've discussed, why Moana residents have a microchip implanted? Ah, what I love about this place. So they can be located if necessary. But it also allows the transfer of important information. Oh, you mean, like, brainwashing? Everyone has free will up to a point. And who decides that point? <laughs> it must be so simple, being you. At least in Waimawana, we are free to be happy and safe outside. It's a rather different story. You really believe that, don't you? More to the point. 
Your chip is no longer functioning. And that's unusual? Oh, there have been cases. A keyless electrician, for instance. Oh, sounds like a design flaw. The charge necessary to deactivate the chip is quite high. The others all died, Alec. My guess is you had help. Have you reported this to anyone? No. Why not? Let's just say I'm exercising my free will for now. The generator should. It's probably nothing. We'll continue this discussion. Just a bit sore. Lips are fine, though. Yep. It's definitely you. You can tell? I can tell. Come on. What are we doing? Exercising our free will. We get out of here, keep on driving. Now, while the power's down, this is our chance to see what's out there. They can't track us if there's nothing working. This is crazy. Probably. Don't you want to know what's out there? What if out there is as bad as people say it is? Uh. What if it's not? Look, I have to come back to Becky sometime, so if you don't like it... I'll take my chances. Becky, will you hurry up, please? I'm starving. We can't find Marshmallow. Well, then he'll just have to miss out. It's open. Kelly. Hi, Roy. But we'd have a picnic since the power's out. If Becky can ever get herself ready. That might not be the best idea right this moment. Why's that? It might be better to stay inside until it's all cleared up. Till what's cleared up? There's been an attack on the power transfer station. What kind of attack? Someone blew it up and the transmitter on Mount Tane. No. That's not the worst of it, I'm afraid. We've been told that we have to be on the alert. Strangers have taken some children. Kidnapped them clean away. Children? Little Hayley Marshall was playing outside one minute, the next, gone. What kind of monster steals a child? Is he a monster? No, of course not. Um, change of plan. It's a bit chilly outside. No, it's not. <laughs> well, I'll leave you ladies to it. Be safe. Yes. Um... Uh... I know. Let's have an inside picnic. 
then it's not a picnic at all. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Christian, lunch is ready. Christian! He's not there. Where is he? He said he was going over to the park to play soccer with Kyle. Remember? Oh, Mum! When was this? Uh, maybe an hour ago. An hour? Where was he going? Uh, home, he said. Maybe he's in his room. No, Kyle, no, he is not in his room. Any other ideas? Um, uh, sorry, Mrs. Ross. Uh, is Christian in trouble? No, he's not in trouble. It's fine. Everything is just fine. You kids should go home. Go home right now. Right now. I got into their computer system. There was no file for Alec Ross. It's my real name, John Sheridan. Huh? What? You don't look like a John. Well, how does a John look? Different. Oh. <laughs> Anything else? Uh, John was married. Presumably not to Kelly. Oh, it's quite a horror movie to in there, John. <laughs> I'm Alec. Uh, John's the bad one. Sure. Sure. And what about me? Well, the good news is your real name is Jessica. According to your file, you were convicted of murder. Who am I supposed to have murdered? It didn't say. Only that it was a double homicide. Well, did it even say why? No, I was trying to access more information when... Bingori... Yeah. Knew all of this. Crap. Something's coming up. I think anything went that fast in Wabawana. Are they after us? I can't outrun them in this. I know her. She's in Becky's class. Shit! So what now? Uh, well, we're down to half charge. I mean, we've probably got enough to get home. Or... No, we've come this far. Right.
ever do what you're told? No, not usually. There were at least four kids in there. And a baby. What now? Oh, shit. Are they really monsters? No, don't be silly. You said they're monsters talking. Nikki, will you stop talking? For a minute, all right? I need to think. Oh, thank God. Is there a monster in the house? No. We'll stop. Wait there. Don't hate it's me. probably just the upstairs telly, all right? Stay there. Out. Get dressed. Locator ID, Jessica Wilmoth. I'm sorry. This locator ID is not an operational range. Uh, expand range. This service is currently not available. Contact your Safeway Security Administrator. Exit. Roll up your sleeves, Gordy. We're going to be here for a while. It's okay. It's okay. Stay still. We're back online. Oh, we couldn't have left him. I know. Oh, too late. Well, what do we do? Uh, uh, follow my lead. Uh, hey! Hey, guys, we need some help here. There we are. I saw them snatch her from wellness, so I, I, I followed. There was a van and at least two guys. Now, she managed to escape during the shootout, but the kids are still in the van. Down! On your knees! Down! down okay, okay, knees. okay, but they're getting away! Move it! Obviously, she'll need counselling. What for exactly? It's not as if he was forcing her into it. Certainly not from what I saw. She's 15 years old. And? And I would have thought it was obvious. Not as obvious as Paige has been lately. You're blaming Paige. I'm saying they were both responsible. It was their choice. You don't choose when you're a child. Your parents choose for you. Oh, lighten up. I wasn't much older than Paige when I married Alec. Well... Like father, like son. Uh, I think that you should leave it now. It's a pleasure. Why don't you suggest to Alec to have a long conversation with Christian about promiscuity? I'm sure he's a font of knowledge in the subject. You know what? Stick your innuendo, you snide bitch. Way to go, Mum. Oi, you. Hold still. This way. the patient. Hi. Uh, are you the specialist? <laughs> Richard Foster. So you're not the specialist? Regional head, Safeway Security Options. That was quick thinking today, Alec. Safeway Security? Yeah, it didn't feel too bloody secure today. Was it Richard, did you say? Who are those people? That's what I'm trying to find out. Take a break. So. Talk me through it. What happened? Right. Uh, well, it, it was pretty crazy. Because uh, the power was down. And uh, I, I went outside to get a breath of fresh air. And that's when I, I saw this big van tear up. Miss Wilmot say why she was there? It was to see me. Uh, I had a bit of an accident last night. I fell down drunk. <laughs> Lucky for Miss Wilmot. 
No, no. It's not like that, <laughs> mate. I, I, I'm a married man. Uh, no, no, I, I just I just, I hang out with her, her boyfriend. Uh, do you know him? Uh, Gordy Leach. I do, actually. Oh, that's why Moana for you. One degree. Yeah, so, uh, so what then? Oh, yeah, um, I, I jumped into the nearest car. Well, I thought I'd lost them. And, th and then I came around a corner and they were stopped. Man, it's all a bit of a blur after that. According to Miss Wilmot, she opened the van door, had a struggle with one of her captors, allowing her to escape. Yeah? Well, I hope it was a big bastard. I feel like I got stomped on by an elephant. You're a good man, Alec. Real hero. What were you doing? Where were you? I was kidnapped, Gordy. But don't worry. Alex saved me. It's been a really long day, so... You know. Well, you should have a lie down. Uh, I'll make you a cup of tea. No, I want you to go now. Yes. Aren't you afraid I might murder you in your sleep? You lied to me. You told me there was no file. No, no, I didn't. You didn't tell me I'm supposed to have murdered two people. I think I'd remember I that. I was trying to protect you. I don't need protecting. Except maybe from you. Get out. Jess. It's Alec I want to be with. And you know that. You've got to be sorry you said that. What a day it's been. Yeah. Oh, and on top of it all, I had the hugest fight with Hope about Christian and Paige. I found them in bed together. Really? Mm-hmm. Our bed, actually. <laughs> What's wrong with his own Hope? bed? Hope carries on as if it's all Christian's fault, Paige's little Miss Innocent. Uh, well, you've had fights with Hope before. Mm -mm. Not like this. Called her a bitch. Wow. And I will never forgive her. Oh, Doc's here. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Good night, my darling. You sleep well. Mm. Take good care of him. I'll do my best. Yeah. Mm. She seems a little upset. How about tomorrow? Won't she still be upset tomorrow? Her outlook may be a little brighter. And does that go for everyone? The injured workers will still be injured. A workplace accident. Oh, accident. Right. Would it be better for them to know they were attacked? Or parents to grieve their stolen children? Well, how will you get away with that? They'll remember that their kids have gone to stay with relatives or friends. In a few weeks, they'll return. Only it'll be someone else. You replace one face with another in the memory and the brain does the rest. You don't have to be affected by these adjustments. Your new chip. I could arrange to have this implanted. Or not, it's your choice. Why are you doing this? My Moana is only as good as the company that runs it. And I'm afraid something isn't right. You might be useful if you can stay alive. Thanks. Maybe now you'll trust me. Who is John Sheridan? Who? Ask the name of someone that I've come across. I don't know, but I'll try and find out. Now, Alec, 
It might be a little strange after the adjustments. Everyone's going to lose a day or two. A day or There's two? There's nothing we can do about it. No, but Jessica and Look, I... Look, if you care about this girl, you're not going to say anything or do anything to stop it. If the download isn't completed, they will know, and I won't be able to protect her. You have to let her forget. That's enough of those. You can have some in your school lunch. So, here you are. Hey, Dad. Hi. You finish your breakfast, darling. You'll be late. Yep. Oh, my God. What, what, what have you done to your face? Oh, yeah. Um, I, I can't actually remember. You can't remember? Hmm. He fell over drunk, probably. I <laughs> was daddy drunk. No, he was not. He was playing cards, that's yeah. all. Yeah, right. And now he has a whole day of work ahead of him. Lucky day. How's Christian today? Any plans? All right. How about Paige? What about it? Alec, don't be such a tease. Hi, ho. How are you? Are you serious? Oh, yeah. You're blushing. Sorry I didn't make it over last night. Weren't you supposed to be playing cards with Alec or something? No, something came up. Work stuff. Problems? Nothing I can handle. Now you get a promotion, you get extra responsibility. Yeah, okay. <laughs> hey, can I walk you to work? Sure, why not? Yeah. I saw this major thing on YTV the other night. It was about our restaurant. <laughs> will seem be the same as believing. Give your old man a hug. You're really my father? Will escape now be an option? He says he can get us out of here. If it's true, will you come with me? First, we have to get you and Hannah out of here. And one more. You are not going to mess this up for me. It's your business with Mr. Ross. You leave Alec Ross alone. Can true bonds now hold him? I can't live without you. Or will his heart be wrenched in a new direction? I love you. This is not my life. Next Thursday, TV1. How did you do it? Why didn't it take? Who are you? I'm Harry. And now I never happened either. Find Harry, because he knows who you really are. And, uh, Hannah, there's someone called Hannah. Come with me, Hannah. My name is Vicky. Confirm identity as John Sheridan. File request Jessica Walmart. She was convicted of murder. She's better off not knowing. Me. Our chance to see what's out there. They can't track us if there's nothing working. I'll make you a cup of tea. No, I want you to go now. Yes. Yes. Aren't you afraid I might murder you in your sleep? Your new chip. I could arrange to have this implanted. Or well, not, it's your choice. It might be a little strange after the adjustments. Everyone's going to lose a day or two. Hey, can I walk you to work? Sure. Why not? I saw this thing on YTV the other night. I'll leave you to it. I'll be right there. 
Stephen wants to see you in his office now. Shit. Hitting the fan, what have you done? What the hell are you playing at? Uh, I'm not exactly sure. It's not on, mate. It's not on. <clears throat> ah, so this is the man in question, is it? Mr. Sheridan. Alec Ross. It's Harry. Harry Sheridan. I've been hearing quite a bit about you, Alec. What a great honor it is to have you here with us. You can. If I'd known, I would have organized. Uh, Steve, a... mate, how about you check out where those coffees are at, huh? And some biscuits if you have them. Yeah. Uh, flat white. I've sent my PA out, so. Uh, chase her up. He's a good fellow. Will do. So. Uh, what brings you to Waimawana, Harry? Water business, mainly. And then I thought I'd drop in and meet the man who keeps coming to my attention. How's the family? Fine. The lovely Callie. Did you two get over that rough patch? The boy. Christian. And Becky, isn't it? Cute kid. You know a lot about me. Well, maybe I read your personal file on the way in. Okay, you want to cut the crap and tell me what you really want? Offer you a job. It's an excellent opportunity for you to advance your career. Why me? Are you the best man for it? For some reason, your work ethic has improved a great deal. Recently. I feel like I've changed. Maybe you have. Yeah. Quite a lot. You know. You cunning little bugger. You know. You so bloody well do. Come on. Give your old man a hug. Not fair enough. I suppose we ought to get to know one another before the manly embrace. Hmm? You're really my father? Mm. For my sins. So who does that make me? John. John Sheridan. A right royal pain you've turned out to be. What's this about? No idea. But he said he wanted to talk somewhere private. Hello, Jessica. Richard Foster, Regional Director, Safeway Security Options. I'd just like to ask you a few questions, if you don't mind. Did you know that Gordon Leach worked for us? Goody? No. Are you two are together? Yeah, he doesn't talk about his work much. I'm oh, glad to hear it. <laughs> Aren't you um, curious about what he does? He said he couldn't discuss it, so... What about your friends? Are they curious? I don't really have that many friends. What about Alec Ross? What about him? Well, he's a, a friend, isn't he? Yeah. Gordy hangs out with him, too. And he met Gordy through you? In a way, I guess. How did you meet Alec? Why am I in a water? I used to work in accounts. This a bit of a step down? It depends how you feel about being a whore. 
I was at the go-go club before this job. Didn't you know that? Hey, maybe that's where we've met. Checking details is a necessary part of the job. Well, can I go now? Needs a bit of fine tuning, but I look forward to working with you on it. Me too. Here we go. <laughs> Sorry about the delay. Uh, what's happening? Yeah, I was just talking to Alec about helping to staff a new water plant. In Waimora? No, no, South Island, straight off the glacier. Cleanest water left in the world. I'm going to have to steal this fella for a few months, all right? Months? Yeah, it's a big job. Well, I'd be happy to put my name to... Naturally, you, you were top of the list with the board felt, and I agree. That why Moana's way too valuable to leave in anybody else's hands. I understand. Of course. Good man. We should try and squeeze in a meal while I'm here. Absolutely. How long are you... Uh, oh. Bugger. I'd love to stay and chew the fat, but you know how it is. Alec, walk with me. So I don't want to talk here. Meet me later. The Hibiscus Hotel, do you know it? Nice. Very nice. <laughs> nothing. We have nothing. That'd be a fair assessment, eh? Terrorists blow up essential utilities, they steal children from under our noses, and after a week's long investigation, we have nothing. They knew where to strike, they knew when to strike for maximum effect. They knew where the kids were. They knew too much. And I want to know how. I want to know who helped them. Now, I'm aware that the head office and their wisdom have cut our budget, but they still expect results. Johnny Guinness. Not a lot, actually, or too much. With all the chaos, nobody behaved the way they usually do, created a lot of background noise, and Johnny got confused. AI does have its limits. Artificial idiot. I've created a list of the most obvious security flags. Alec Ross isn't there. You've already seen him, so I didn't think you'd need Don't to. think. Just do. I need to talk to you. You're a popular girl today. Now is not a good time. Oh, I don't care about gossip. Well, maybe you should. There was a guy asking questions about you. Richard Foster. You know him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He interrogated us after we tried... After what? Oh, this is too strange. Okay. A few days ago, we tried to escape together. We did? Yeah, but they wiped it. They, uh, they snipped out the day or so, the way they do. Well, and I don't remember any of this. There's something else. Harry's here. You found him? No, he found me. And he says he's my father. Oh. But you don't believe him? Well, I honestly don't know, but here's the thing. He's an important guy, and he says he can get us out of here. If it's true, will you come with me? Yes. You sure? Yes. Uh, I, I don't know the details yet, but as soon as I know, I'll, I'll, I'll let you know, okay? Uh, hang on, hang on. Stay. They wiped. Did we do anything that I should know about? I'll tell you all about it one day. Did I? Hmm. Even when no one else thought you had it and you, I never, ever did. 
Thanks. No, you know what I mean. Yeah. Bubbles. We need bubbles. <laughs> oh, wait. We're not supposed to be drinking. The Our fertility program. We're seeing Dr. Collins tomorrow, and now this. They have doctors in the South Island. Uh, I know. Oh, oh but wound up. <laughs> The thing is, I'm going to have to go down on my own first, just for a few days, to check out the situation. When? Soon. Uh, maybe even this weekend. <laughs> yeah, I'm going out. But Christian, dinner's nearly ready. I'm not hungry. Yeah, in angst. It's Paige. No, it's not. They're just friends. Friends who kiss? I saw them. Becky, you should not be spying on people. What kind of a kiss? <laughs> a sloppy kiss. Well, if we're moving away, he'll just have to get over it. Alec Bloody Ross. How does Alec Bloody Ross get this kind of opportunity? What's the connection to this Harry person? Well, he must know someone. He hasn't got the brains to swing it on his own. Christian has come to visit. Fabulous. You have given your all to this company. This is so unfair. Is Paige here? In her room. It's a school night. You need to talk to the head office. Tell them you have some concerns about the arrangement and Alec might not be the best candidate. I'm not sure I have any grounds. And make them up. Who is this Harry Sheridan, anyway? Not someone I get on the wrong side of. He's on the board. For God's sake, Stephen, grow some testicles. Hope, shut it. All right? Hotel. Why and why the water must pay well. Continue tracking. I'm sorry, that option is not currently available. Hibiscus Hotel is for important visitors, the kind that don't like to be observed. Doors open. Crack the top off that, will you? Thought we'd eat in. Why Moana is a great place, but privacy is a bit of an issue. Well, you're going to pour us both a drop of that, or what? What's the plan about leaving? <laughs> your, your manners haven't improved. What's this? Specs for the new water plant, of course. Cost, personnel numbers. Even I can't conjure up a couple of air tickets to a non-existent water plant. Read it carefully. There'll be a test later. How did I get here? I put you here, of course. You and Han. It was meant to be a temporary arrangement, but sometimes things don't go according to plan. And then you were doing your level best to stuff things up. What things? Does it matter? I could tell you anything and you wouldn't know the difference. Well, how do I even know you're my father? Jesus, you always do that. Oh, what do I always do? Wind me up. Can you prove it? What? Any of it. Oh, don't be a dick. Well, there's no plan and no proof. There's no point in me being here. Yeah, yeah, all right. All right. Pick up your handbag. It's a photo. On paper. It was Sarah's idea. This is Becky. Hmm. She'd been, um, three or four. Might even have been her birthday. Real name, Hannah. And that's her mother, Sarah. Your wife. Paige. Christian, you're still here. We were just studying. I see my... Actually, I can drive you. That's the cow to my walk. No, it's no problem. Dating? Not as strong, isn't it? What would you call it? A friendship? He's a teenage boy, hormones on legs. And she's a teenage girl. Precisely. Which is why we need to put the brakes on before it gets out of hand. Christian's bound to find someone more suitable down south. Or Paige will move on to another boy. 
Oh, did I mention how thrilled I am to hear about Alex's new job? I know. <laughs> Isn't it just great? So out of the blue. Well, I suppose all that hard work has finally paid off. <laughs> Alec and hard work. <laughs> Sorry, but that's something you don't expect to hear in the same sentence. Well, his attitude's changed. Like, someone must have noticed. They must have. Well, I've always had faith in him. Yes, you have. And I should get home. Huh. By the way, where is Alec tonight? Oh, you know what it's like, more high-powered meetings. How boring for you. Don't forget to talk to Christian. Your mother was a lovely girl. Wife number two. But my favorite by far. She died of viral cancer. You were four, five. So you wouldn't remember much of her anyway. Well, I prefer something to nothing. Memories are just stories we make up as we go along. They change, they mutate. I suppose to make me feel better. Mm. Drink up. <clears throat> Will I get it back? My memory? I don't know. But if anybody can find a way to, you can. You were always a very smart boy. Did I tell you that? Uh, first, we have to get you and Hannah out of here. And one more. I need to bring one more person along. Female person? Oh, God, you could chip off the old block. But it's not possible. Well, it's non-negotiable. No, you, you have no idea. You have no bloody idea how difficult this was to set up. Well, I'm sorry, but no, I... No, you are not... You are not going to mess this up for me. Not again. Besides, what would you say to Sarah? What about her? Well, she's involved. I don't think she's expecting a threesome for her trouble. Jess, I need to see you. I'm sorry, I'm not interested. My boyfriend and I are just sitting down to dinner, actually. Shut up. I have to see you. As soon as you can, let me know. Good evening. What can I do for you? I'm wondering if I might have a word, sir. If there's any way I can be of assistance, Safeway Security really value our contract. I have no doubt. Eugene is our biggest client, after all, so if there is anything... Off the top of my head? It would be fair to say there are a few concerns about the goings-on here. Repairs to the power transfer station, for a start. And the quarterly financial review is not looking too good. I have consistently requested more funding. Uh, throwing money in a problem is not necessarily going to cure it. No, but... And then there's a the quality of life issue. Well, with... The good people of Waimoana pay good money to be here, most of them. We can't have them thinking they live in a police state. There are other ways, I assure you. Oh, more assurances. Um, I have an idea which could... Yeah, well, I won't hold you up. I'm sure you've got a lot to occupy yourself. Yes, I do. Ella Cross. I hope you haven't been spying on me, Richard. Ella Cross is a person of interest. Ella Cross? Uh, I doubt it. It's your business with Mr. Ross. That would be commercially sensitive. Well, it's been a pleasure meeting you, sir, and once again, if there's anything I can do, I'll keep it in mind. She wants to keep them apart, she can be the one to tell them. 
Never come between a lioness and her cubs. Who do you think I am? A lioness? <laughs> yeah. You know something? Might not be so bad moving away. Oh, but you love it here. Best little place on earth. Not as much as I love you and the children. It's only a couple of months. With any like Christian will forget about Paige and... Oh, Christian, darling, I didn't mean... Oh, right. Now he blames me. Dad. What? Harry wants to see me again. Now? Uh, no, surely you can call him. Oh, he prefers face to face. Uh, what am I going to tell Christian? I thought you were a lioness. Meow. Just what it's going to be like living with a high flyer. Uh. So, this is your wife. So he says. He, he could be lying. He's your father, Luke. <laughs> I don't like him much. <laughs> you don't have to love Darth Vader if he can get you off the Death Star. I can't leave without you. Of course you have to. No, I can't. I would. I'd be gone in a shot. She's very beautiful. I don't even know her. But you will. Come on, she must have had something going for her if you married her. And she's Becky's mother. Well, only according to Harry. Why would he lie? I don't know. He's... he's... he's slippery. You have to do this. For your sake. For Becky's sake. Just go. Find out what happened. Find out who you are. It's everything you wanted. Not everything. Maybe you can come back for me. I don't want to go. If you want me, I'll be here. Jess, there's something I've got to tell you. Yeah, I can wait. No, 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 not the bed, not the bed. I'm a murderer. It's just a computer file. I can easily be manipulated. But... I might have killed two people. Maybe you had a good reason. Well, you should go. Gordy might turn up here any minute. Gordy. Right. How are things between you two? Fine. You know, no matter what you might think, he really does care for me. I'm going to find a way for us to be together.
At least I won't be left wondering what it might be like. Well, as a matter of interest, what was it like? <laughs> Get out of here. No, look, I'm, I'm going to talk to Harry again. I Why think would I he can... change his mind? Well, I don't know. Anyway, maybe I... I only showed you because I knew I wouldn't have to face you at work every day. You're amazing. I'll go. Really? You are sleepyhead. If I come to wake you, didn't even hear you come in. Yeah, it was like. I got up this morning and the first thought I had was Eggs Benedict. Maybe it's a subconscious thing, you know? Eggs, fertility. Okay. You haven't forgotten. Got our appointment with Dr. Collins this morning. I know that your career is very important, but having another baby is still our number one priority, isn't it? Sorry, I didn't make a pack last night. Pulled a late one. It's fine. Did Richard Foster talk to you yesterday? Yeah. Charming guy, your boss. Why didn't you tell me? Didn't get the chance. So, what did he want to know? Mm, just about how we met. And about Alec. Oh, there was nothing to say. Why does it always come back to him? You gotta listen to me, Jess. Richard's got a problem with Alec. And Richard's not the kind of guy you want to mess with, okay? What sort of problem? I don't know. It's got to do with security and it's putting us all at risk. So please, please, you got to stay away from Alec, okay? Sure, not a problem. You know, I only say this because... Because you love me. You know I do. <laughs> There's no physical reason? Are you sure? Just keep practising. <laughs> oh, that's so great. Oh, because, because, you know, we'll be away with Alex's new job and I, I wanted to make sure and I don't know. Oh, New job? Mm. It's in the South Islands. Wonderful, wonderful opportunity. Kelly, I'd like you to give me a sample, please. Um, I thought we were all clear. I'm just covering all our okay. bases. I don't want to work with Alec about keeping his end of it up. Oh, no problem there. I can assure you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I thought we had an agreement. Do you know who Harry Sheridan is? He's on the board of Eugene. The company that controls Waimawana water, amongst other things. You knew. All this when time. you said your real name was John Sheridan, naturally I made the link. Who's keeping secrets now? <laughs> but seeing we both have trust issues. What are you planning to do? Well, now isn't a very good time to be trying for a baby. Are you going somewhere? Maybe. 
Well, let me put your mind at ease. Kelly is infertile. Though she could be implanted with the donor egg if it was appropriate. So Christian isn't her son? Well, why do you care if you're leaving? Perhaps you should talk to me before you make any other rash decisions. Yeah. Sure. I, I don't care if it is difficult, Josie. Or bloody impossible. Just do it. Mr. Sheridan? Uh, later. Well, I don't remember booking you. But hello. I'm sorry. Harry Sheridan. Dr. Natasha Collins, wellness. Ah. I understand you're working with Alec Ross. News gets out. Drink. Oh, not for me. I'm surprised that you haven't requested a medical update on Mr. Ross. Well, perhaps I already know what I need to know. Perhaps you do. Maybe you can help me then. I've been trying to contact someone on the board of Eugene for several weeks. Things have been going on in Waimawana, some of them disturbing. Uh, perhaps we should carry on this discussion in my suite. Hmm? Nothing else will do wonders for my reputation. Please. I can't say I'd ever want to go to the South Island, but, um, congratulations. Thanks, Jude. Will you miss me? Oh, I'll be crying myself to sleep. Ah, uh, here's Stephen for your two o'clock. Uh, what will I do without you, Jude? I was wondering that myself. Close the door. Hey. Uh, thanks for coming down. Is there any chance of, uh, smoothing things over with hope? Sorry? About Christian and Paige. That's our two o'clock. Yeah, well, it'd be good to sort it before I go. I have worked my butt off for this company. Whereas you... You're a joke. Well, not anymore. That doesn't excuse you going behind my back. I didn't. Then how does a man like Harry Sheridan find out you even exist? Well, I don't know. Oh, bullshit. But, fair warning, two can play that game, and information is power. What does that mean? The art of life is the art of war. Have you been reading a book, Stephen? Is that meant to be funny? Oh, no, no, I meant, uh, I'll keep it in mind. I agree with Hope, by the way. Christian is not fit company for my daughter. Nice spot. Very, uh, peaceful. You need to see me. I hadn't realized how bad things had got at the Dubois Moana. Imagine if word got out. The board would not be happy. What are you saying? Safeway is contracted to look after Waimoana and other communities in accordance with a Eugene guiding principle, strict and binding principle. Someone has not been playing according to the rules. In what way? Bodies rotting in a pit. Shootouts. What is this? The Wild West? Heard some overzealous people, but uh, like I said before, we had budget restrictions. <laughs> people die because you can't balance your books? The people involved have been dealt with. We have new measures and... Where's the measures. report? Why hasn't it come to the board's attention? I considered it an internal matter. You considered? What do you want? What makes you think I want anything? I assume that's why we're meeting here, and not, say, in front of the board. You may not be as thick as people say you are. I'll keep it simple so there's no confusion. You leave Alec Ross alone. He's mine to deal with. All right? Certainly. Hey. 
haven't you gone yet? Well, Harry still hasn't said when or how. Uh, but in case there's no warning, I just... I want you to have this. Great. A photo of your wife. It's me. So that whatever happens, when I come back for you, you'll know that it's really me. I don't need this. I won't forget you. Jess, they I could... Won't... me that if it's too dangerous to come back then don't anyway. shit sorry uh, I'll call you back it's time to do this no no I, I can't I'm not safe journey Alec. just listen hang on a minute Off. Damn, I've got fertility yoga. I could cancel. Oh, no, no, you go. That's important. See you tonight. Uh, Cal. Uh, Alec, what? Uh, uh, have fun. Okay? I will. Love you. Yeah. I'm not the bad guy here. It's Harry Sheridan you have to be careful of. He's corrupt. What's he got to do with anything? Well, I know he got some information from somewhere, and I know that you went to visit him in his hotel. I was curious to meet him. Oh, casual visit, was it? Don't piss me about. I believe in best practice. Ethics. Well, you're a good doctor, that's why you're here. But you didn't buy into this like the other good citizens. That privilege has to be earned. Any problems with your work, you can always go back. Is that a threat? Absolutely. Harry Sheridan is not one of us. He believes in nothing. He's using Eugene for his own ends. I'm listening. Well, that's a start. Am I really going on a helicopter? You really are! This is gonna be so cool. Christian's gonna be so jealous. I'm just gonna call Mum to say goodbye. Oh, no, no, not now. Uh, it's only a weekend away, and you can call her at the airport, okay? And then you can tell her all about the helicopter, too. How about that? Okay. Can I have some food? Sure. I'll be right down. Oh, and don't forget hair and marshmallow. Uh, yeah. Did you want to know about Harry? Smart guy, you might figure it out. I have to get away. They're coming. 
And whatever Harry says, whatever he wants you to do, don't believe him. I know he's your dad, but he's shafted me just like he always wanted to. You, good? I can't get to you or Hannah. Harry's got her and get Hannah and get away before it's too late. I'm so sorry, my love. Whatever crap has gone down between us. I love you. You have to believe that. But you can't trust Harry. My party seems to have been delayed. I might as well board now. I'm sorry, sir. There seems to be insufficient sea credits in your account. No, that can't be right. You must be doing it wrong. Try again. Still the same, sir. You are Harry Sheridan. Of course I bloody am. And you've been staying at the Hibiscus Hotel? I'd like to speak to your supervisor. Sir, if you can return to your hotel, we'll sort this as soon as possible. There's another flight in the morning. I don't want to be on a flight in the morning. I want to be on that flight now. Is there somebody we can call, sir? No, there bloody isn't. And I'm on that flight. Sir, I'll have to ask you to step back and refrain from using offensive language. Sir. Shall we go back to the hotel now, sir? I'm so sorry, my love. And whatever crap has gone down between us. Dad! I love you. I want some snacks. You have to believe that. But you can't trust Harry. Dad? I thought we were supposed to be in a hurry. Always searching. This is you, Alec. Never finding. Who are you going for? Always wondering. Why am I here? Never knowing. I'm going to find out. Now, the episode. Shall we? When the terrible truth. I really need to see my family. Will suddenly become clear. You arranged it. People have risked their lives for you. I don't run for anybody except you. This is not my life. Next Thursday, TV One. See 
тебе закличе до розової рани, до заліче, до кресіту, до себе закличе. Можете летіти, 